also not what I was looking for. The specific odd, the specific computer that has a, a neat little video vignette that I want to see. Desmond. Of course, I guess it's just a few seconds for you. I'm gonna leap down the playlist. Um, anyway, uh, I was talking about Clay. Uh, Kazmarek, uh, Subject 16. So, when I fell into a coma back in Italy and woke up in the Animus Black Room, it was uh, so calming. It felt like I uh, had woken up into a dream. A haze of dream where none of this mess had ever happened. Uh, felt like I should just be getting ready for another day of pouring drinks at bad weather and uh, another day of complaining about being between girlfriends and wondering what the hell to do with myself. But uh, when I saw Clay just sitting there, it started to come back, you know, piece by piece. And when he told me about Lucy, I... Uh, Fuck, you know, it, it, well, she deserved it. Fuck her. She was a she was a traitor. You know, realizing that I killed her. Not thinking or feeling anything. Not at the time anyway. Well, and things just kept piling on. There were more memories of Ezio and Altair and the first civilization. And then right before he vanished. Clay passed on his memories to me. He showed me everything he had seen and lived through, and it was it was brief, but overwhelming. I'm not really sure how to explain. He saw glimpses of Adam and Eve and their escape from slavery. He saw the beginning and the end of the war between the first Civ and humans. He saw Minerva, Juno, and Tinia trying to work out their their calculations. At least that's what they called them. They, they had these tools, these powerful uh, machines that could predict possible futures. Not what was going to happen, but what, uh, what, what could happen. Probabilities. And, well, they spent a lot of energy trying to figure out what was the most likely scenario for the future. Theirs and ours. And in the end, I guess they figured I was their most likely candidate. Some guy named Desmond, living at the beginning of the 21st century of the Common Era. But which Desmond was the right one? Because, you see, probability is a weird thing. It can branch out in so many ways. Which version of me did they need? Was it the Desmond who got married early and had a son? One who stayed single in New York? Or, or was it the Desmond who moved to San Francisco to be a waiter? Maybe uh, it was the Desmond who worked at an auto body shop in Chicago, or maybe it was the me who never ran away from his parents in the first place. First Civ had countless variations to choose from, but in the end, the uh, lucky one was me. I'm the Desmond their best calculations spit out. I'm the Desmond they left their messages for, and I guess I have to live with that honor. Makes me a little bit sad hearing Desmond's voice again because uh, I have the knowledge of knowing that we're never going to get another, another, you know, protagonist like him again. All the modern day uh, characters moving forward are getting a bit, really a bit, a bit stale to be honest. Like we have, yeah, we have Buddy Boy here that we're playing as you know, the faceless, bodiless Astrogo drone who does stuff for. Circle inter Entertainment, and then later on we get the uh, the person from 
uh, I don't know who what the fuck the guy from Unity and Syndicate what his deal is. Right. Well, then after that we get uh, no, I... Layla from Origins, Odyssey, and Valhalla. With them, and I'd like to. Oh, what do you mean live with them? You live here with me. I'm sorry, Edward, but my father is right. You had a decent wage when you worked the farm. Why can you not be satisfied with that? With me? Decent wage? That job was near as damn it to robbery. You want to be married to a peasant the whole of your life? All right, Edward. All right. You leave now, Caroline. You'll never know what's coming to us. Caroline! Caroline! Well, you, uh, blew that one, Edward. Wake up, can we? Maybe not hit me with a stick? He left this morning with the galleon, as Faith will discover a good use for this old cove ourselves. Aye, we'll make something of it in time. We could keep a fleet here if we like. And with a bit of fixing up, it'd be a decent place to call home. Might even convince my wife to come one day. You're married, are you? In God's eyes, I am. She left me some time ago. Even so, keep that fact hid away. Most of these pirates don't respect a man with higher commitments than rum and plunder. Call mine honor. Let me know if you find anything. What was the, the point of you smacking me with that stick if you're not gonna have a? Oh, never mind. Same wonder, like, why would you hit me with that stick if you, if you don't have a higher, like, a better reason for disturbing me? By the way, do you want to reward me for taking care of one of those Templars for you? I mean, I know you're an assassin because you wear hidden blades. Do you want to maybe pay me back for all my trouble? Odd looking things, aren't they? Old and weathered. Is this what they call Mayan? Or is it Aztec? Are you good with riddles, Edward? Puzzles and ponderings and the like. No worse than the next man, why? I think you've a natural gift for it. The way you think and work. The way you understand the world. Well, I don't know about that. You're talking in riddles now and I don't understand a word. Clamber on top of this thing here, will you? Help me solve something. Yeah, we already want to maybe mention that we've already done this a few times already. Ah, oh, right. I know this feeling. I have since I was a lad. It's like using every sense at once, isn't it? To see sounds and hear shapes. Quite a combination. Every man and woman on this earth has in them a kind of intuition hidden. Yeah, I'll be taking this from myself. Mine now. You are a gifted man, Edward. Has a strange look. Is it worth something? Nothing you can spend. But if you find all of them, it'll lead to something grand. How many? A few dozen, I think. This way. I've something else to show you. Edward, why are you not questioning what, how cagey he's being? He's like being... That, apparently, apparently I missed one there. Good to know. I found something else just here. Yeah, I sure you have. Take this much oh, Steve's back. Oh, there it goes again. He keeps coming back to like, tickle my nose and then it, it goes away before it actually does anything. Actually, rather annoying, but that annoying me 
Whenever I sneeze, I roll the dice. Oh. Excuse me, I roll the dice of triggering my fucking uh, sinuses. What do you think? I think Monsieur Ducasse is a man of many secrets. Aye, and look here. A solid staircase leading God knows where. What do you suppose lies at the top? From what I knew of Ducasse, I wouldn't be surprised to find eclectic instruments of torture and villainy. An Iron Maiden or a collection of thumbscrews. Or a pair of anguish. <laughs> the fuck is that? Not a nice way to kick off. But that is some damn fine gear. Try the key you took from Ducasse. How do you know about that? You weren't here for that. That's one. Only four left. Aye. It might be that these four Templars have them. See the names here? They've been sent to kill these four targets. Hang me, that's the map I sold to Governor Torres in Havana. He said it marked the location of assassin encampments. You think maybe you owe them a bit of warning then? If you have any kind of heart beating in that chest. Suppose I could. If it leads me to the four other keys. Bad excuse is better than none at all. Ooh, what the fuck? I will meet with him later because there is so much shit I didn't get I didn't get when I was here last time. Nice house though. Mine now. Have a chest. And with fragment over there, we can go and grab. There's a fucking lot that I didn't get when I was here last when I was here originally. Anyways, while we're doing all this, I hope all you guys are having a lovely, lovely day. My day has been pretty chill. Didn't really do a whole lot beyond relaxing and, and uh excuse me, relaxing and playing. Planet Zoo, a game that is consuming a lot of my free time, and I probably shouldn't let it do that. I had meant to work more on my script today, but clearly I didn't do that. I'm gonna need to do that. I'm a, I'm a, what the fuck is that? Definitely gonna resume. Working on it on uh, tomorrow. Once I get home from work, I'll put in a little bit of a little bit of effort into working on the script, and then we're going to stream tomorrow. Stream some more Jedi Survivor, and then we'll maybe stream again on Wednesday. Thursday I'm recording, Friday I'm recording, Saturday we can stream, Sunday I'll stream or record, we'll see about that. This week's a bit weird as far as hours are concerned, I'm not gonna lie. Really, oddly, um... Oddly spread out. But you know that worked out for me, because in the end that means I can work more on, on the uh, stuff I've been kind of slacking off on lately. You know, record more record more of my, my current playthroughs, work more on my side project. You know, try and get shit, try and just be a bit more productive and get shit done, you know?
Wait, where'd he go? Why are they going that way? There we go. I must say, please don't fly away from me. Right, next up is over here. I really did leave a lot behind, didn't I? I don't know why we get over there. Excuse the yawn and Pete, everybody. It's, it is a little bit late. That's not the way I want to go, now is it? How does one go about getting over there, huh? Is this it? Edward, my friend, I think you're being just a little bit over with your with your leaps there. Maybe calm it down just a little bit, bud. Not need you launching yourself too far and dying. Chest over here now. One, two. So, okay, so that's all over there. Ooh, ooh, that was that was a that was that was a, a risky one right there. I haven't checked my channel in a little while. I wonder what video we're on to we're we're up to yet right now on the on there. Pretty sure we're still having the uh the uh Red Dead and and uh Last of Us videos go live. I mean I'm, I'm I am very certain not Last of Us. I think we're still still having Red Dead go up, like right at the very tail end of it. Oh, by Taylor, I mean I think we we've we got the prologue going live now. I don't know how many more videos are left to go live. I just know that we're toward.